restricted areas. I need that Rothesite if we want to complete the Neuroam. Good, you're here. It's time to put a plan in motion to take full control of this situation with Infinity LTD. In due time, we don't know to what extent Infinity has taken the current NeuroAmp schematics, so our top priority is completing our own. Let me introduce you to Vina Kalra, Head of Research and Development. She'll give you the initial details. Yes, details. You see, the internal NeuroAmp is supposed to consist of two parts. The first part, the part Infinity stole, handles the manipulative effects. The second part is a shielding modification, designed to protect the user against other NeuroAmp... users. Well, we can't, but the shielding aspect was never officially a part of Project Dominion. It was an afterthought of how to safeguard our own people from being manipulated, so it was being researched separately as a mod. The research itself was in early stages, too early for board approval, so only myself, Demarcus, and Masako know about it. Big time. We'd be the only ones unaffected. No one wants their greatest asset used against them. Once Vina can complete the internal neuroamp and shielding mod, the plan is to outfit you with both and have you infiltrate Infinity LTD. We can't risk the assignment until we know your mind has the necessary protection. Of course. Installing experimental technology into your very head. What could go wrong? You're a Ryujin employee, and we need a job done. We've trusted you this far, so I feel it's safe to continue the trend. Good. That's all I wanted to hear. And all I need is the last piece of the puzzle. The final kink in both designs was finding compatible materials to use for conductivity that the human body wouldn't reject. I finally created the perfect alloy, but it requires a newly discovered refined element called Rothesite. Which is where I come in. We have a confidential contract with Consolidated Mining to gather, refine, and ship the Rothesite straight to us. Their last shipment is late, and neither we nor Consolidated Mining have had any communication with the Karenay Station. My thoughts exactly. We need you to head out there, secure the shipment, and bring it back here so Vina can complete her prototype. And I want to know what happened. We need to take any safety measures to make sure this doesn't happen again. Unfortunately, yes, so be prepared. Extensive tests and research were done on the planet, so the chances that this is environmental are slim. And setting up a station like this is second nature for consolidated mining, with plenty of redundancies in place to handle mechanical failures. That's what I like to hear. The mining station is CM Station RC-1. It's on a moon called Karen A-3A in the Karen A system. The shipment should be in the research and control tower, but the outside doors are kept locked down. This keycard will let you enter the mines so you can access the tower from the inside. 
Good luck. I just the entire station was wiped out by something. Don't worry. You want to chat? Find Demarcus. He's always. I'm not sure if those Maroon Zealots live in space. What can I do for you? Got anything you need to offload? Trade authority is always by. Kiosk right here for you. Okay, no problem.
No organics here. Uh, valuable minerals, perhaps. I wonder whether the result of the analysis here was good news or bad.
is worth check. Never know what you might find in their pockets. Impressive investment in equipment. Someone certainly considered this worth the time and credits.
not to leave anything useful behind. service, Captain. You see any heat leeches? You got it. This area's off limits. Authorized personnel only. An outbreak? I haven't heard anything about this. Understood. Uh, here's an access card. Good luck. <laughs> Any adventure you can fly away from. Is, is that how the saying goes? I'm tired, all right. Just not. Hey, who let you in here? This is a restricted area.
Fine. I'll tell you. We're on a private contract with Infinity LTD. It's for something they call Project Dominion. Dr. Lane and I were instructed to conduct human trials on several... volunteers. So far, only one patient has survived. You're telling me? When Infinity hired us, they said human trial authorization was already underway and we'd have the approvals in a matter of days. The days went by and nothing. Every time we'd ask, it was always just days away, but we kept working. Between the money and potential success, it was easy to tell ourselves that they'd come through. Sean, what the hell is going on here? Who is this? It's moments like these when I think I just need to hear someone say it out loud. Sean spoke the truth. We thought the approval would arrive any day, so we continued with the project. By the time we started to catch on, it was already too late. We were too immersed in the lie. Doctors are supposed to act ethically. Approvals or not. You... You really think that's possible? Hey, who let you in here? This is a restricted area. Fine. I'll... We're on a private contract with Infinity LTD. It's for something they call... Dr. Lane and I were instructed to conduct human trials on... So far, only one... You're telling me? When Infinity hired... The days went by. Between the money and potential success, it was easy to tell ourselves that they'd come through. Sean? What the hell is going on? <sighs> it's moments like these when I think I just need to hear someone say it out loud. Sean spoke the truth. We thought the approval would arrive any day, so we continued with the project. By the time we started to catch on, it was already too late. We were too immersed in the lie. Doctors are supposed to act ethically. Approvals or not. I think you're being a little overdramatic here. No, he's right, Ken. It's what you and I both deserve after going along with this mess. How long have we talked about walking away or refusing to work? We oversaw the death of nine people here, and it may as well be ten. Infinity may have lied to us, but they also paid us well enough that we did nothing. You'd let some stranger like this just ruin our careers? Yes, and you're going to let them too. Go ahead. Get whatever information you need to take this place and Infinity down. I'll make sure Dr. Lane remains cooperative. To think I did all of this to help my career. If you are free soon, could we talk? I wanted to thank you for giving me the chance to work with you. I know we met under, um, unusual circumstances. You seem to be acclimating well to Constellation. Are you enjoying working with them? I think none of us were expecting what we have found. Well, perhaps, Matteo. You have certainly become a vital part of the organization. That is a credit to your abilities. If I may, from what you have seen, do you think I fit in well with the rest of Constellation? No, I do not. But I find it hard to quantify. Many of the other members are polite, but distant, 
I worry that my background and my actions concern them. I have not shared much, but everyone knows I worked with smugglers for years. I am no stranger to violence and death. I know. For those that have not lived it, it can be difficult to imagine or accept. Others here have seen conflict, but for more noble causes. Vladimir is the only one here who can begin to understand. He was the one who pressed the group to include me. I lack his charm. He puts others at ease. I fear my presence does the opposite. Uh, that is kind of you. You also have a lot g going. Uh, <laughs> I am... I I find expressing affection difficult, but, um, but truly. Thank you. I know this seems trivial, uh, perhaps childish. I have just always relied only on myself. I have never been surrounded by people like this, by a group I, <laughs> I wish to be a part of. Does that make sense? And yet here we are, working together. And that has, I think, gone very well. Discussing these things is challenging for me. I hope now you can better understand why I wanted to keep the circumstances of our meeting quiet. I wanted to thank you for not saying anything to Vladimir. I know that you said you wouldn't, but it is still a relief. I would like my contributions to Constellation to amount to more than violence. It would have been, to some. Thank you for talking this over with me. It is good to know that at least one member of Constellation understands me.
can't talk. Doing calculus in my head. Are you head. sure you're okay? You left pretty far. Ryujin has certainly taken time to craft an appearance for itself. Almost I've got my well, eye on you. It was your first test run. We're wasting time. Vina needs that shipment. I hope we're keeping... Is that my beautiful shipment? You were right about this one, Masako. Looks like it. This should be more than enough. Now, I shall excuse myself and get to work on finalizing this prototype. So, what did you learn about CM Station RC-1? Hm. Lucas must be desperate if he hired them to collect the Rothesite. Were there any survivors? Good. I may not condone murder, but I refuse to have sympathy for indiscriminate killers like Ecliptic. Especially after massacring innocents working for us. Now, I also had a report that you were spotted at the clinic. I take it you traced the shipment there? I figured it was related. And were you able to determine the purpose of this secure wing? So, it sounds like Lucas has reached a new level of desperation to ensure his future as CEO. Infinity appears to be on an entirely different level of corruption. It cannot be allowed to continue. I'll make sure Yuko's team extracts every bit of information they can from the clinic's database on this. Between hiring Ecliptic and unauthorized human trials, we have enough to take Lucas down for good. And with the Rothesite secure, it's almost time for us to make our move. Not long, according to her. She and Demarcus have everything prepped and ready. I believe it's just a matter of creating the alloy and molding it according to her design. Aren't we all? Head up to the executive floor and speak to Dalton. He has an update for you on the Mole's identity. I've called a meeting, and I expect you to attend. It's time to put the final plan in motion. <laughs> 